All right, silver is up today, uh, back over 31. Didn't quite edge under 30, uh, but it's tempting, it's close. And so I was looking at the one year silver chart here. Uh, you can pull these off of any number of websites, basically give you different year breakdowns. Uh, this is the one year price. And one thing I noticed looking at this is, you know, you can see a uh, couple of spikes. There was the, you know, year the high of almost 49 there and we dropped quite a bit under 35 and then built back up a little bit lower 40s big tail off drop down 30 um, we're kind of in a in between small valley and peak here so really not sure where everything's going obviously no one is but something that kind of strikes me is potential thought on lower silver prices you know 20s low 20s mid to low 20s you know the whole notion of trend is your friend and you know so with a straight edge you can we can kind of look at uh, where the bottoms are putting us so if we're due f to keep that trend going and you can see that's going to put us off the chart obviously because it's in the future but you know we're looking at something over here so that's the 25 line so you know potentially could be down you know low twenty dollar silver and this year's a little different. It's an election year, so there's a lot of stuff going on with that. And that can, uh, you know, adjust people's emotions towards things like precious metals. Obviously, the economic factors with industrial uses of the metal as well. Uh, so, I don't know. I'm just taking a look at that and seeing low 20s. Of course... I have no idea. I don't know the future.